Hi guys, today we're going to film a video, we'll probably do a two part video on building a side table or coffee table out of this ash log we've got here, ash log cookie. Um, we acquired this about 18 months ago, it's locally sourced, grew within pretty much a few miles of our workshop here which is nice. And um, first part we're going to build a router sled and get this nice and flat and then look at probably putting some Dutchman joints in the um, cracks and splits here. And that's the side we sanded just to get a bit of a feel for the grain. Cool.
right, so now we've finished with the router sled. You can see the texture left here behind the router. Now, due to this being end grain, it does come up more rough. But um, after sanding, I've given this a quick sand, probably sort of five minutes sanding. Um, and you can see the lovely grain that comes up. We've got the splits. Um, so we're gonna put some Dutchman joints, some bow tie keys in the splits here and um, maybe fill some of the smaller ones. Sand the other side up. But we've got a nice, even, flat surface now. Even thickness throughout. It was six inches and it's now five and a quarter inches. So I'm pretty pleased with that. And the next stage will be to sand it up and build a base. So this is our router sled. We're probably gonna look at putting some basic plans up to show you how to build one of these. Um, so if you're interested, there'll be a link to that on the video. Um, but essentially what we've done, we've built this to purposely suit the log that we flattened. So I've done it a couple of inches wider at each end. And then you just need to make sure that your height here is just enough to fit your piece that you're gonna surface in underneath. Um, so that you've got clearance with the router sled on the top without catching into the timber. Um, and if you're doing a thinner piece of material, something not as thick, then I wouldn't build the sides up so high. Um, so yeah, I hope that helps.